crashing Hit a wall Right now I need a miracle Hurry up now I need a miracle I'm a you now that I need you on things to do when you're bored in the summertime. The summertime can be super great and super fun, but if you're not going on vacation or you're not really doing much, it can get pretty boring and you'll probably find yourself stuck at home with nothing to do, watching Netflix or watching YouTube videos the whole entire day. By the way, I'll be doing my first Q&A video ever super soon, so if you have any questions for me, be sure to leave those down below or you can also ask me on Instagram or Twitter. Without further ado, let's hop on into it. My first idea is to plant some kind of fruit, vegetable, herb, flower, whatever you really want to. You can do this in a garden outside or you can also plant something in your room in a small pot. Now I'm gonna reap what I sow. I'm left seeing red on my own. Got a feeling that I'm going under, but I know that I'll make it out. My next idea is to have a awesome pool party at night with all of your friends. You can get out the glow sticks, and also I made these really cute DIY pool noodle candles in my DIY pool party video I did recently. So I will leave that link to down below in the description box, or you can click on the screen if you haven't seen that already. I quit calling you my lover. Move on. You watch me bleed until I can't breathe Shaking, falling onto my knees And now they past time would be reading a book. Lately I've been reading the book Life Just Got Real by Sadie Robertson. It's basically about two very different girls that have very different backgrounds and different personalities and basically all their experiences in high school. There's a lot of different awesome stuff in this book. I would definitely recommend reading it. Honestly, I'd rather be somewhere with my people. We can kick it and just listen to some music with the message. And we'll discuss our big dreams, how we plan to take over the planet. to go to a super cute coffee shop or ice cream shop. I went to a really awesome ice cream shop called Heritage Creamery when I went on a road trip in Waco, Texas. It was very awesome. The ice cream was absolutely amazing because it was freshly made there. It always tastes a lot better when you get fresh ice cream at an ice cream shop near you instead of going to a store and buying a carton of ice cream. Oh, yeah. oh, I asked myself what am I doing here? Speaking of that, you can go to some really cute home decor, beauty, whatever kind of lifestyle shop you want to. Now you don't have to buy anything at these places, you can just look around because they have a ton of cute items and you can take Instagram pictures that look very tumblery. Also a lot of these shops have very cute room decor ideas that might inspire you. Number six, have an epic dance party. Something awake and move and last but not least, do a very awesome obstacle course. And of course, you have to make it a competition. Hello, Wait. welcome to your interview. Is this real leather? Did you get a cow? I can't sit here. Okay. so excited. I mean, I don't really race to race. I just race to have fun. Who does fun when it's a competition? I just, I know I'm gonna crush them. Five, four, four three, three, two, two one, one, go! I, I was 
getting nervous at this point because that turn, it slowed me down. I wasn't ready. I was like, oh no, what, what have I gotten myself into? What if I don't crush them? And then I was like, uh, what, who are you kidding? I am going to crush them. I was doing pretty good on the race, except then it came to the couch thing and I was supposed to jump over it. And then I kind of like stalled a little bit, which probably got me behind some points. Okay, I feel like so pumped. Hold on, I need to sit down. So I was going down, and then I see this frog in the middle of the in the middle of the grass, and I was like, I have to save it. But then I remembered I was doing a race, so I couldn't really save it. But I felt like really bad for it. But I kept running, and then I hit the doorbell, and then I went back to save the frog. after the race. I mean, I even congratulated a few girls. I hope everybody does great. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Thank you. Good job to you too. Good job. <laughs> but we don't really know the results. But um, I just would like to tell them congratulations. Go to Hideaway, Hideaway. when you're bored in the summertime. I really hope this helped you and I hope that you're not bored anymore if you were bored before. Don't forget to leave the questions down below to be featured in my Q&A. I will be answering most or maybe even all the questions in my Q&A video. That is all and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! What? <laughs> no. Ow! <laughs> you should have said it was calling for me. Oh, okay. <laughs> Okay, now, um... My feet are getting tired! Now you're getting ready for the race. Okay. You're like... Hello! Hello! <laughs> okay, now how do you feel at the middle of the race? <laughs> we should get... We should get me filming and try to save the frog! Yeah. Come on!